There are two distinct functions between our counting numbers and our arithmetic numbers and so on and the language that we speak. Prior to the advent of the Hindu Arabic numeral system, the same set of symbols served a dual purpose. They were the letters of the alphabet, but they were also the counting numbers, the, the integral values. What's the significance of that? Well, you could say, well, there's historical significance to it because, oh, well, it makes sense. Maybe you'd use the same set of symbols for this dual purpose until somebody figured out, well, hey, maybe it would be more convenient if we had this set of symbols for numbers and numerical calculations and counting and this and that, and we use this set of symbols for our spoken language and our written language, right? Well, when you go back pre-Hindu Arabic numeral system, it means that when you look at these ancient writings, particularly the, the, the writings that we would perhaps define as scriptural or sacred writings, what is it that, that qualifies them for that definition?